hello students okay today we are going to discuss about an important topic adolactonization okay so the main precursor for this reaction is that is a gamma delta unsaturated carboxylic acid okay so the first step is that halogenation okay so here we are using iodine so what will happen so iodine will undergo addition okay followed by some intramolecular reaction so you will end up with this kind of cyclic ester is called lactone so we can go through the mechanism the first step is that what i told that that is iodation reaction iodination will takes place so it will end up with the, this kind of iodonium ion okay if it is bromine it is bromonium ion okay so here it is iodonium ion okay and here we only represented the relative stereochemistry that is uh, the iodonium ion in the plane of paper okay next step we are using a very weak base sodium bicarbonate so the utility of sodium bicarbonate is that deprotonation of this carboxyl group okay so deprotonation give you this carboxylate ion okay now clearly it is a nucleophile so here we can have electrophilic center what will happen it will undergo intramolecular s2 reaction it will end up with a nice product that is cyclic ester is called lactone okay so here we are only discussed the relative stereochemistry so the our problem the given problem uh, we have to consider some stereochemistry so we can check we can uh, uh, discuss the, uh, the detailed manner the given question okay so we can so this is our question so okay for time being we are considering two stereochemistry so considering the stereochemistry we can have two possibilities okay ready so this is our starting molecule or precursor so here we are consider the carboxylic group in wedge that is above the plane of paper here we consider the carboxylic group below the plane of paper right now first we are going through this situation okay so the addition so this halogenation strictly takes place below the plane of paper why because above the plane of paper having this bulky group so this iodonium ion will be in dash why because this is present in wedge okay <clears throat> now on deprotonation we will end up with this carboxylate ion now next it will undergo intramolecular SN2 reaction strictly so this group above the plane of paper that is it is present in the wedge so strictly this intramolecular reaction happen from the above the plane of paper so it will attack in the above through the above plane so what will happen and this bond will leave and this iodine remains in wedge dash that means below the plane of paper so your product will be like this that is attack happen in the through the above plane okay and this retained in dash okay clear while we are looking through this pro this situation so clearly our carboxylic group in dash that is below the plane of paper okay so clearly halogenation will takes place in the above plane why because below the plane having this bulky group ready okay now by deprotonation we will end up with this uh, carboxylate group this nucleophile so strictly this is present in the below the plane of paper it will attack at this electrophilic center via this below through the below plane of paper okay right and uh, this bond get cleaved and iodine remains in wedge that is above the plane of paper so your product will be like this so according to the given option the correct answer we can have these two but the option in the given option we can have this product so this is our uh, correct answer option b okay thank you take care